All right, uh, welcome back. Uh, this is Minyak. Today we'll be l watching another World of Warship video. Okay, this is the tier five uh, premium uh, Russian cruiser, uh, the Mikoyan. Okay, the Soviet cruiser or uh, Russian cruiser is the same. Well, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> well, it's the old stuff. Anyway, uh, if you guys like this type of video, uh, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe, okay? So I'm titling the today's video, uh, Mikoyan Glass Cannon. Yes, this. All right, uh, I was actually looking at the historical record. There is not no ship called Mikoyan. Unless you count a freighter ship. Yeah, well, the Mikoyan is actually the one that I could find is the manufacturer of the MiG jet. Yeah, so company that manufactured MiG. Well, the name is Mikoyan. Anyway, since I cannot find the ship, let's, you know, a historical record of the ship. I guess this must be a fantasy ship from Blueprint somewhere, somewhere. I don't know. Okay, so the ship. Hmm. Okay, so the ship in game it has three turret twin barrel. So yeah, total of six gun, 180 millimeter caliber, HE damage 2,500, AP damage 4,550. The range of the gun is about 16.2 kilometer. Yes, and the HE fire chance is about 11%. Oh so, yeah, this ship is actually has a pretty badass gun. <laughs> oh, because the the size of the gun, the range, and damage. Uh, well, the AP damage. The ship has a very good AP damage on the gun. Okay, armament. Uh, other armament is the torpedoes. Uh, two by three torpedoes, fourteen thousand four hundred uh, maximum dam damage. Four kilometer range. Okay, that is a downer on the uh, torpedo because the torpedoes are just four kilometer torpedoes. Yeah, you will probably for just need to forget that. It, uh, well, I don't know. Well, it, the torpedo is only for emergencies, I guess. Uh, when the enemy got really close to you. Okay, so what else? The survivability of the ship. 21k, yes, only 21k. This ship is almost only have a, well, a destroyer HP, I guess. So, yeah, this ship is very brittle. 10% uh, uh, torpedo protection. The armor plating, 13 millimeter in the front. On the side, it's only 35 millimeter. So, garbage, garbage level armor. <laughs> Citadel area is raised, so yeah, the citadel is above water and it has a very long citadel. Yeah, well, pretty much survivability. Mm, downer, garbage, loser. <laughs> so yeah, very bad, bad survivability for the ship. The speed of the ship, 35 uh, maximum, 35 knots, uh, turning circle, 820. So yeah, this ship is a very fast ship. Uh, good turning, um, well, turning rate is that good, but the rudder shift is good. So, uh, yeah, it can change uh, direction easily, but the turn is uh, very hard. Okay, what else? Concealment value, 16, well, 11.6 on concealment, so quite stealthy ship for well, tier 5. What else? Guns on the AA. Uh, well, it can do about 90 HP damage uh, or H920 explosion. 50% reinforce on the... Uh, well, if you use priority sector. Garbage. <laughs> Garbage AA. <laughs> so, yeah. Hmm, hmm. Well, I guess the ship is a total glass cannon. It has a very good AP on the gun it, like i already have um, let me see three citadel yes well this game is uh not a very big game because this is six versus six oh, i'm not going to be a bit long game and most of the ship well it does not have any battleship like kind of weird but uh, it's there 
So this ship is yeah very fast very man well the maneuverability is not so this is essentially a destroyer with citadel and big ass gun <laughs> big ass gun uh but yeah it is a 180 millimeter gun so yeah the, the, the yeah well too bad for that guy he's eating the ape of this gun so this ship ap even if even though it's not citadel it's still going to hurt because it's 4550 maximum on the ap and it's uh the traverse time of the shell is quite fast too so you it does not uh what do you call it, it does not like uh Stay in the air for very long because the uh, traverse time is quite fast. Alright. One citadel. Okay. I am actually running away because, well, this ship has is very brittle and I'm trying to not get killed. Yep, three citadel on the same uh, Furutaka. So I have actually tried this sh uh, this ship on the tier seven battle, you know, fighting against uh, against uh, another cruiser. Yep, it, the result is still the same. This ship can still do citadel, even on a tier seven cruiser. Yeah, that's how how powerful the gun is. But ex you know, everything else about this ship is actually bad, though. So yeah. Well, considering this is a destroyer, yeah, it actually has a destroyer speed, but destroyer does not have citadel. This thing has a very long citadel and it's above waterline. So this ship is very, uh, <laughs> it's very, very brittle, very, you know, the ship itself is a, you know, okay, think of it this way. You can create a Citadel Fiesta with this ship. Yeah, because like Citadel party with the ship. But you are also the Citadel Fiesta of other ship. <laughs> yeah. I mean the, the armor plating is 35 35 millimeter on the side. Yeah, I think the if I'm not mistaken, the Monte Cucocli on the Italian has a thicker. Okay. Ah, I forgot about the. Uh... Is that the consumable? Yes. This thing has hydro for dealing with pesky destroyer. Hiding in the. In the... <laughs> yeah, he is hiding inside the smoke. Yay, hydro. So dead. <laughs> So yeah, this thing has hydro and also spotting, uh, spotting plane, spotting plane. Uh, well, right now it's sixteen point two. If you use spotting plane, this thing can actually hit 20, about twenty kilometer. So yeah, very fast. Uh, well, the range is very long on this. Flip of a tongue. Okay, so this ship can actually go twenty. Yeah, about twenty kilometer on the shooting range. If you use the spotting plane. So this ship is uh well, it's complete glass cannon. People can kill you easily and you can kill people easily also. But yeah, I don't I've actually tried um ambushing is not recommended. <laughs> going brawling, you know, uh going to well, if you actually try to brawl with this ship, you are going to die. I have actually tried uh, brawling a battleship with this, uh, you know, with this ship. The secondary and citadel this ship. Yes, that's how bad the play, you know, the armor of the ship. A secondary from, uh, you know, a battleship can kill this cruiser. So, yeah, you better stay away from... Uh, well, 
try to kill people at range, not up close and personal. So this ship is not up co close and personal ship. The AP, however, is very good. I mean, really good. Really, really, really good. Right now, I have a high caliber and already have 7 Citadel. But yeah, I do not have um, a lot of... Uh, you know, not a lot of enemy ship left. Yeah, I, I think I have actually played on other games with this ship that actually have like something like 15 or 18 Citadel. Yeah, so this ship can yeah, pretty much do a lot of Citadel. It's a Citadel Fiesta ship. But at the same time, it, you won't... Sometimes you don't last that long because if you actually got uh, focus fire by battleship, either you hide or you die, that's it. So yeah, this ship play style is best if you play it mm, cowardly. Hide behind island while yes, running yes. away, kitting. Yeah, that's kind of uh, the best way to play this uh, user. All right, let me pull out the uh, result. Okay, so I have a high caliber on this one, uh, 65,000 damage, but this is a tier four, tier five battle. So uh, it's quite a lot for a cruiser. I mean, if uh, you are a battleship, that's, and this game does not. Have. Okay, uh, 66 hit. Oh yeah, I forgot something. Uh, yeah, the reload on the main turret is 13. 13.2 and also the torpedo reload is 70. Yeah, just in case you are wondering what's the reload rate of the ship. I'm just I am just old and forgetful. <laughs> so yeah, this thing can punch uh well it can really punch other cruiser. I mean I killed a shore using this ship and it citadel the shore. Yeah, that's how good the gun is, and the shore is actually Two tier above uh, this ship. So yeah, this ship can really pack a punch on AP side. You could actually just use AP and forget about the AP. Yeah, that's well. Uh, I haven't actually tried citadeling a battle. That, that this thing should be able to uh, citadel a battleship. But yeah, I am not inclined to, uh, you know, go face to face uh, fighting a battleship. Because yeah, one shot from a battleship, you're dead. Yeah, the survivability is just garbage level survivability. I think the 21k is probably the lowest in any cruiser tier 5. Uh, yeah, so this is like uh, driving a destroyer with citadel. And yeah, you put a big ass gun on top of it. Pretty much it. Oh, and also the reload because the reload is 13 point and also they only has six gun. Yeah, so you have to make pretty much every shot count. So uh, DPM is not going to be really high. It will be better for a ship that has like five second reload than this. But it, when it hit, it pack a punch. Uh, pretty much that's uh, how I describe this ship. Okay. Uh on the team score yeah, i did uh seven well the AEA experience is seven uh 1785 so yeah i'm on top of it but uh, yeah i actually got two kills still to well the enemy got two well some of my but uh pretty much this ship mm, yeah well, it's very dif difficult to play the ship because it's, uh, well, the, it won't last very long if you don't, if you are, you know, uh, very aggressive. Yeah, it won't last very long because it uh, does not have a armor. Armor is totally, totally, totally bad. Okay, let me pull out the detailed report. Okay, that's 24 on the Furutaka Phoenix 12K. I on 12k, Hosho 8k, uh, voice. Yeah, well, the. It's complete glass cannon. Like, uh, complete glass cannon. You can kill people easily, and also you can easily 
get killed by other uh you know by other people yeah pretty much as how i describe this uh ship some people don't like uh, glass cannon yep anyway okay this is the end of the video uh, thank you for watching i will see you guys again on the next video all right uh this is Minyak signing out